Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. So we have been reviewing the Windows 11 with the HP laptop, both touchscreen and non-touchscreen. It's in the X360 device with the Intel Core i7 processor and so far so good. They all work well despite the fact that the window is still in a better stage. If you've not watched the video, you can check them out on our channel. So today we are going to be reviewing the Windows 11 with the Dell XPS 13. The XPS 13 we are using for the preview has a beautiful 13.3 inch full HD touchscreen display with the 8th generation Intel Core i5 8250U processor. It has a 8 gigs of RAM and a 512 gig SSD and a backlit keyboard on the window hello fingerprint. Okay, installing Windows 11 on this laptop is quite easy. Just like uh, every other laptop will install Windows 11 on. So the installation was successful. There is no compatibility issue. Even uh, updating the driver from the Windows update was also successful. There is no any missing driver. All the drivers updated successfully. You can see from the fingerprint, it's locked. I'll just tap it. You see, it's very fast. And then when you are browsing with the Microsoft Edge, everything display, I've never tested other browser on this one. On this laptop, you can see the YouTube is displaying fine. So you can see it even eBay is displaying fine. So everything seems to be working fine, except one issue that I discovered. On this one, I've never discovered it on that laptop. So when you are uh, when you right click on the desktop, maybe you want to change the desktop wallpaper or something. When you right click, so uh, maybe I click somewhere else now. So the screen is going to flicker. Look at it. You see, there was if you notice there is a flicker, even when I want to. Okay, then another issue was this. This option is not supposed to come down below this tax bar. So this option is on. So there are some times that the option can even go down that you cannot see the, some of the options, the ones that are at the bottom. So those are the two main issues that I discovered on this particular laptop. So then... And that's bring me to the next point I want to make. Now, these issues that I just highlighted are not there on the Windows 10. When I was running on Windows 10, everything was fine. So when you install a Windows 11 on your laptop and you started having some issues, so it might not necessarily mean it's a, a bug on the Windows 11. So sometimes it might be a driver incompatibility issue. So the driver can be installed quite well, but it might not be compatible with the OS. So like this one particularly, I'm thinking is the graphic driver is not compatible with the Windows 11. So that is what I want to point out. So if you have this type of laptop and you cannot wait for the final release of the OS, uh, maybe towards the fall, and uh, you can deal with this issue. To me, it's not a deal breaker, but I don't know about you. So if you can deal with this issue, so, and you've been wondering, okay, you don't know if you install Windows 11 on your laptop, if it's going to be usable or if it's not going to be usable. So if you can deal with, with these two issues that I just mentioned, then you are fine. You can go ahead and then install Windows 11 and enjoy your Windows 11 just like I'm enjoying. And um, believe me, I like the new UI, I like the new team, and uh, the new wallpaper. So they are really, really beautiful. This 
this thing is my favorite this cool new wallpaper so that's it guys so thank you for watching my video and please do subscribe to my channel for more video bye